we want to invite you to go get anything you hit, shake, or scrape to make sound. Anything you hit, shake, or scrape to make sound. If you can find something that you hit, shake, or scrape to make sound, for example, uh, please don't use any knives or forks, but if you have a couple spoons, you can, you can grab a, uh, a pot or a pan and make a sound like this. We also have free birthday parties that we do for children 12 and under, typically ages 2 to 12. The kids under 2 don't get the joke, but 2 to 12, and then also for seniors. Now, I want to caution you, Jerry is, he's very concerned about the virus. He's very concerned about the virus. So uh, let, me, uh, let, me bring up, let me bring up Jerry. Okay. Okay. Okay, come on, Jerry. I, I, I can't understand you, Jerry. What? I, 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 can't, I, I can't understand him. Um, okay, <laughs> all right, come on, Jerry. I, I, I can't. Is that my mask? Did you take my mask? You took my mask? I need a mask. No, no, you don't need a mask. You don't need a mask. You're not real. Oh yeah, all right. Okay, okay, okay. So I'm gonna take off your mask. Okay, all right. Let's take off your mask. <laughs> Who are you? Uh, Kevin Driscoll. Who? Kevin Driscoll. I mean, your uncle, Kevin Driscoll. Are you a girl? No, no, I'm not a girl. You look like a girl. I, I, I'm not a girl. You got long hair. I, I know I have long hair, but I'm not a girl. I, I have a beard. I know you look like an ugly girl. <laughs> Okay. All right. Ready? Yeah. Okay. Let's do. Let's do this. I'm gonna sing a song. You wanna sing what? The, what, what song you wanna sing? The birthday song. You guys the birthday song? Yeah. So I'll play bass drum with my right foot, and uh, hi hat with my left foot. So the hi hat is two on two and three, right? So it's one, two, three, one, two, three. Yeah. That's right. Okay. So then, happy birthday. Hey, happy birthday. I, I, I don't, I, I, I don't know, I don't know, we'll, we'll see, so it's, uh, 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 ready? Happy birthday. Stop it. You can't. You have to. You can't do that. If I if I take out the gag, will you be good? If I take it out, will you be good? <laughs> okay. Don't do that again. Go good. Go good. You're really old. He's just a hick, you know. He's just a hick. <laughs> well, he's, he's right, boys and girls. I, I am a hick, but I'm a legitimate hick from Sumner, Nebraska. Tiny town, tiny town. It was a very tiny town. But we even had a zoo. Had? Yeah, we, we had to close the zoo. You had to close the zoo? Why? The chicken died? <laughs> Jerry, you're not funny. You're not funny. You're funny looking. You're not funny. Go, go, go get Doug. Go get Doug the dog. <laughs> okay. Okay, so I'm going to... You going to come back later? Yeah. Okay, so I'm going to bring out Doug the talking dog, right? Yeah. Okay, so I'll put you down. Yeah. Wait, wait, wait goodbye to the folks. Okay, yeah? Hi. Doug, you know, you know why, see, uh, Lance type too funny? You, you know why? Yeah, I'm naked. <laughs> okay, Doug, uh, all dogs are naked. You're not. No, I, I'm not a dog. Oh, yeah? <laughs> I'm, I'm not a dog. Oh, yeah. Hi. Oh! No, no. no. Please, Doug, not that, not that. Again, please don't. Oh! I'm, I'm sorry. He wants to do his his impersonation of Elvis Presley. But when we perform at the schools, churches, and libraries for children, I have to remind the children that Elvis Presley was a singer that died a long time ago. And, uh, yeah. are you gonna sing Hound Dog? Not yet. Not, not yet? No. Uh, what are you gonna do? Oh, he just wants to do his impersonation of Elvis Presley, the singer that died a long time ago. So I'll count to three, and you do your impersonation of Elvis Presley? Okay, okay, so, uh, Doug's gonna do his impersonation of Elvis Presley, he's not gonna sing, Hound dog right now. He's just gonna do his impersonation of Elvis Presley. So I'll count to three. You do your impersonation of Elvis Presley, the singer that died a long time ago. Yeah. Okay, ready, Doug? Yeah. Okay, here we go. One, two, three. <laughs> okay, so you uh 
Oh, I got fired. What? I got fired. You got fired? Yeah. You had a job? Yeah. I, Doug, I, I didn't know you had a job. Where, where was your job? Walmart. You had a job at Walmart? Yeah. What was your job at Walmart, Doug? Greeter. You were the greeter at Walmart? Yeah. Um, and they fired you? Yeah. Well, Doug, that doesn't sound like, um, uh, doesn't sound like a really hard job. All you have to do is say, hello, welcome to Walmart. Yeah. And they fired you? Yeah. Doug, did you say something else that got you fired? Doug? <laughs> Doug, did you say something else that got you fired? Yeah. What, what did you say? Did you say, hello, welcome to Walmart? Yeah. And then and what else did you say? Then I said, welcome to Walmart. Get your junk and get out. Doug, that's not appropriate. Yeah. I got fired again. You, you, get, you got fired? You had another job? Yeah. What was your job? Right, what, you're too embarrassed to tell the, tell the folks what your job was? Yeah. Whisper in my ear, tell me. Yeah? Really? Oh, okay. Well, he was, he was a babysitter, and the parents fired him because he fed the children crackers. Wait, wait a minute, crackers? Yeah. You fed the children crackers and they fired you? Yeah. Uh, Doug, that doesn't sound, uh, that doesn't sound right. Uh, the, you, were a baby, you were a babysitter, and the parents fired you for feeding the children crackers. Yeah. W what kind of crackers were they? Firecrackers. <laughs> Firecrackers, okay. All right, well, that's probably a good reason. Okay, sing a song. <laughs> Coronavirus blues with Doug the Talking Dog. Where can we go? What can we do? I don't know. The coronavirus blues. The coronavirus blues with Doug the Talking Dog. Where can we go? What can we do? The coronavirus blues. Cowbell! And your own instrument, like a water bottle. And this is a Tahitian toyer or a log drum. Hi, I'm Jerry, and I'm gonna sing a song. Hi, I'm Doug the Talking Dog, and I wanna sing a song. Uh, you, hi, you guys wanna sing together? No, no, you're not that good. No, he's not that good. He's, he's, really, he's really not that good. But let's let's sing a song anyway, okay? Yeah! Hi, I'm Mickey the Monkey. Hi! <laughs> I'm Greg the Green Monster. <laughs> Greg the Green Monster, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> Triangle, bell tree, Irish boron. Drumming with timpani melts. 
Slapstick. Slapstick. Rain stick. Drumming with brushes, softly. Get louder, crescendo! I just want to leave you with one, um, one, one last uh, piece of um, guidance that I got. As, as you know, Boston is heading for probably the worst week, or uh, that's what we're told. And I, I found this, this quote. It's, I, it's not original. I didn't make it up. Uh, but it is uh, from one of the doctors from one of the hospitals in Boston. And it's, he's the CEO of the, one of the hospitals. It says, we are just now moving into the thick of the battle, and we will emerge to the other side together by distinguishing between worry and panic. Worrying can galvanize, galvanize us and drive action, while panic will only stop us in our tracks. I'm certainly not saying don't worry. I do hope, though, that we can take our worry and find in it motivation to do what each of us does best. And with that, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, it is now exactly 10.30. I want to thank you. If you have uh, other friends, invite them to come to our 2 o'clock show. Every Wednesday, have Wacky Wednesday, because Wacky Wednesday, you whack sticks or you whack something, uh, whack drums or whatever. Don't hit each other, but, but you whack uh, percussion instruments or anything you hit, sh shake, or scrape to make sound. Fred, can you do your impersonation of uh, Elvis Presley? Oh, gosh. <laughs> <laughs>